guys, King in the North here, back with some more of The Last of Us Part 2. Last episode, we uh, found Ellie as Abby nearly killed, well, we killed Tommy, uh, and then nearly killed Dina and Ellie, but Dina being pregnant stopped Abby from doing that because um, the kid was there or something, I don't know. And now we're living life, uh, here having PTSD moments of Joel. Hunting took a little longer than I thought. Who's here? Uh, just come inside. Oh. <laughs> Ow. Well, that's quite a bit you Wait, what? Hey, Tommy. Get shot in the there head. Here, let me take it. Come here, bud. Oh, oh, yeah. Go. Here. Oh, I got it. I got it. Hey. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to see you. Mm, you too. You're getting heavy. No, it's just a big ball of muscle. Hmm? <laughs> Town's good. Maria good? Oh, she's fine. We, uh... We're taking some time apart. Hmm. Oh, sorry. Nah. We talked about it a lot, and, uh... Yeah, it's what we both want, so... <clears throat> okay. Come sit. I got something to show you. So I've been putting out feelers for months now. And this new guy heard my story. He told me about a woman that he traded with while he was moving through California. Described her as built like an ox, traveling with a kid with scars across his face. He said they're living along this coast in a beach sailboat right here. That's got to be her. We're done with that, so. Reckon it's easy. Forget about her. You sitting all comfy way out here? Hey. I'll make her pay. Tommy. That's what you said when we got back to Jackson. Tommy. What a joke. Can you take him, please? Yeah. What was that? Nothing. God damn it, Tommy. You know what we've been through. I'll say it. She made me a promise. I don't fucking care. I know you don't, Ben. That's your goddamn problem. Mm -hmm. Yeah, fuck her. If she's... No. Don't agree with that at all. Totally with Tommy on this. 
totally with Tommy. She was all for fucking revenge and doing all that, and all of a sudden it's like, oh, uh, I have a nice life now. I don't care about anything else. was a journal that she was filling out, I guess, the entire time. I think the most fucked up part is that, uh, it was her idea to do all this, like go after them, and now uh, Tommy didn't really want to do it, and then, you know, he's all fucked up and crippled now. And it's like, uh, sorry, I don't want to lose what I had, even though you sacrificed what you had. about my patrols. Don't go here, don't go there. It's funny how involved he gets whenever you're scheduled to go out. Yeah. She's, uh, she's putting on quite the show. I give you guys two weeks until you're back together. Not gonna happen. She, uh, say something to you? Make it one week. Ellie! Hey! What took you so long? Well, I'm here, aren't I? Tina? Jesse? Come on. Hey, don't forget, we're heading out early, so get some rest. Yes, sir. You're such a dick. Come on. Why don't you start with me? Okay, I have a very serious question for you. How bad do I smell? Like a hot pile of garbage? Oh. Okay. Oh. How about that? Gross. <laughs> you love it. Every guy in this room is staring at you right now. Maybe they're staring at you. 
or not. Maybe they're jealous of you. I'm just a girl, not a threat. Family event. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Remember next time there's kids around. <laughs> yeah, like you're setting such a great example. Oh, just what this town needs. Another loudmouth dyke. What the fuck did you just say? Hey, Ellie, hey. Ellie, don't. Get the hell out of here. Get your hands off me. Hey! Enough. Go for a walk. What about them? You worry about yourself. Let's get you some fresh air. You are a kiddo. What is wrong with you? He had no right. And you do? I don't need your fucking help, Joel. Right. I guess Ellie's a piece of shit, too. Hey. Been a while since he slept this long, huh? He had a day. Yeah. He's fine. Go back to bed. We'll talk about it in the morning, okay? I have to finish it. You don't owe Tommy anything. I don't sleep. I don't need him. I'm not like you, Dina. What? You think this is easy? For you and for him, I deal with it. I love you. Prove it. Stay. So what? I'm just supposed to, to sit here and wait for you? For God knows how long? Just thinking you're fucking dead the entire time? I don't plan on dying. Yeah, well, neither did Jesse. Or Joel. Hey, stop. Hey. Hey. Come on. We've got a family. She doesn't get to be more important than that. No. I'm not going to do this again. That's up to you.
Constance. Now we just need. Oh, we checked this street a week ago. I can't believe you traded a pistol for this. It's a lead. No way that guy saw fireflies over here. Stop. I feel good about this. Well, I don't. Come on. And we're as Abby again. 24, 10. It's not going to be on that side. It's all evens. She doesn't have any of her shit we had. Um. Too close to be twenty four twenty five. Hey, something's out there. Oh, to the left. I sneak pa I can't sneak by this. This kid still has his bow. Shoot this thing, dude. Stealthy and silent. Alright. We're good. Maybe. Let's see. Searching. Can you please? Thank you. Who is that? Oh, right. Bottle. Hmm. Twenty-four, twenty-five, Constance. This oh, is the place. Oh, convenient. Okay, but there's nothing. The here. address. We don't know that yet. to look like the outdoors, but plants don't look like that. It's more like a... a child's dream version of the outdoors. In the old world, it'd be common for them to decorate kids' rooms like this. My dad painted a... a colorful jungle for me. Yeah. Yeah, I would have loved that. I bet she would have. Being positive? I'm trying to be helpful. You're always helpful. <clears throat> Not a. Is it really nothing? It can't be. I still don't know what she's looking for.
Lev, I think we're done here. No, wait. You find something? Scratches. <laughs> Scooch. Hello? Well, how would they have gotten down here? And close it up behind them, cells like that. Since anyone's been here. Unfortunately, I have to agree with you. Pretty nice barracks, all things considered. They were here for a while. That's the shower, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, so I'm uh, gonna have to mess around with that stuff over there, it looks like. <clears throat> they had power down here. Look around. Yeah, it's over here. Guess they've got solar. Oh. Is this frequency currently in use? This is... Do you see a call sign anywhere? Oh, a what? It's a short list of numbers and letters. Hmm. This is Abby from Santa Barbara. Can anyone hear me? Standing by. Is anyone out there? What's this? Those are frequencies. Is this frequency currently in use? This is Abby from Santa Barbara. Is anyone out there? Are these other Firefly outposts? I don't know. Can anyone hear me? Hello? Big Sir? Is this frequency currently in use? This is Abby from Santa Barbara. Hello? Hello? Is this frequency currently in use? Hello, this is Abby from Santa Barbara. Can anyone hear me? If anyone can hear me, please reply. Please answer. Hi, Abby. We got a clear signal on you. Where in Santa Barbara are you calling from? Um... 24, 25 constants. Uh, we got a tip about a base, but there's no one here. We're looking for fireflies. I'm a, I'm a firefly. Where were you stationed? I was part of the Salt Lake outpost. Who ran that facility? Dr. Jerry Anderson. He was my dad. back from the satellite stations and brought him back here to home base. How many of you are there? Four about 200 strong now, with a few more every month. Oh, that's right. You're about to get two more. How do we find you? Get to Catalina Island. Approach the large domed building in Avalon. We'll find you. Okay. Okay. We'll see you soon. Over and out. 
Looking forward to it. Good luck, Abby from Santa Barbara. Over and out. Come on, let's get back to the sailboat. All right, so the fireflies okay. are reforming. Fine. You were right. Uh, what was that? Why do you make me repeat whenever I'm wrong? Because it makes me feel better. And because it happens so rarely. you go from here two four two five constants yeah that's gotta be it <sighs> all right so I don't know. She's captured by... I, I'm assuming the radio is fake now. How would she get up to the street from here? This looks promising. I don't know what I'm doing. You're not supposed to be climbing this? This looks way too... Yeah, that's way too high. Not seeing something clearly here, or am I supposed to just head like the down much further? It seems like you're supposed to go up there, but. I, I'm 
completely lost. Gonna pause it for now and hopefully find my way. Actually, you know what? Instead, let us call this an episode here. We're 30 minutes in. This is taking too long. Um, next episode, I will have it's routed as to where I'm supposed to go, and we'll see if we can maybe find Abby and that kid tied up or something at that house. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Peace.